Whitney, this is the eventual goal for both candidates to run the Golden Dome. Bill Cole says that right now he's capitalizing on momentum and peaking at just the right moment. Republican gubernatorial candidate Bill Cole makes his final campaign stop Monday at the Grill in Charleston, an eatery known for welcoming famous conservative candidates. I'm looking for change. The Grill owner David Arthur says he invited Cole because he's the right man to take West Virginia out of last place. Obama killed this state. I hope somebody can get in here and pump it back up. And Bill Cole's that man. Yeah. We've come from behind. We absolutely have. And it's been a steady rise. And we're peaking at exactly the right time. Cole says despite trailing in the polls for most of the election, he's seen momentum swing his way on a recent tour across the state. What has been the message that has been resonating with the people you're talking to? The need to put people to work in good paying jobs. Many Cole supporters are excited to see Cole reduce the size of the state government. It has been 83 years that we have been in the dark ages here in West Virginia, and it's time to move us forward, and Bill Cole's going to do that. Cole pointed to prevailing wage and right-to-work legislation passed while he served as Senate president as evidence of his forward-thinking practice. He said as governor, he'd lead the legislature to more of the same. It all revolves around putting our West Virginia people to work, so that's job one. It's going to be interesting to watch tomorrow in a state that has such huge support for Donald Trump if there is a down-ballot effect that makes up for that polling deficit and puts Cole over justice for governor. 